Production, and today I want to show you a little design I've made for a skill system. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. And to reset. Okay, everyone, so that was a little showcase of the skill system I've been working on. For a specific map I'm working on, nothing too special, just something I like to do. So, I just wanted to make a skill system, make it all work, and I think today I made a flawless design. And um, I'll just show you how it works. So, what happens is when you press this button, it checks if you have uh, the correct amount of XP. If you do not, it, nothing happens, basically. If you do, it will. Um, what will happen is because it's only one signal, the output will stay on. And to uh, counter that, this is activated, which will replace the command block with the same command, and that will simply just turn off the output. So that will create a pulse that will um, delete five XP levels. As the goal of this is to make just pay five XP levels for a skill level with some effects. So in this case, I made agility. So it takes five XP levels, and this is designed to uh, actually not let it uh, be used again. So level one is not said twice. And um, then this is set block command to set a stone here, stone block. So the next time when you activate it, it can travel through to level two area. And this is to place a redstone block right here. So it will activate this clock which will activate this command, which will give you speed and jump boost. Let me demonstrate it to you. Let's activate this. As you see, now the stone block is placed. A redstone block appeared for sh oh no, sorry, not, not a redstone block. Okay, just it activated. It said level one. Uh, this, uh, this small uh, T flip flop, so pulse goes into a a steady signal, I'm not sure, <laughs> a permanent signal, I think uh, the name is, I'm not sure. And then uh, it's there, but that's for later. And uh, now, the next time when you uh, enter this, only this will run, but because it just replaces two blocks which are already there, it doesn't work. There's already one there, we'll just say, I've, I'll maybe just replace them, I'm not really sure actually, but well. Um, so next time, now let's press the button again. And as you will see, this time it was able to travel through because this block was here. And now it uh, blocked this off. And it's at level 2, and it activated that. And now I have speed 2 and jump boost 2. Now let's activate it again. And we'll do a little bit weird there, but it doesn't really matter. And now we have all this, and we have jump boost 3. So that's a really fancy. So the reset works like this. If this is on, be very simple, this will be open, so you will have to reset level 1. Um, this will probably be there in the real map, or maybe we just do a, a all one button and just give you back everything. But at the moment, just want to be able to turn off individual levels. So now we press the level 3 button, it will activate all this command, which will activate that. Oh, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't see. We'll place the rest of the block here for a very short while. Well, this spear again, which will activate this T flip flop, turn this off, and it will give you 5 XP levels back, and it will delete that as well as the next block. So you cannot access level 4 again. Level 4 they'll make it, but it doesn't really matter. So um, now you'll be able to, when you click the button, you this will be blocked by the way, and now I'll be able to go into level 3 again, as you see. And now if we Do that. We can now do level two again. So let's do that. As you see, level two. Deactivate this. And level one. Deactivate that. And we'll have level like that. And now when we level up, we will have level one again. So that's how simple as it is. And I'll just go through every command block so you can pause the video right now. 
just to get um, an idea of every command block. So um, this will just be sped up and I hope you enjoyed this little showcase. This is actually my first showcase. Just made something interesting I thought I'd show you to you guys. So um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, spotlight. So if you want to know exactly what is in every command, then keep on watching. If you do not want, then just quit the video. So hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. And of course, if you want to already command block, just keep watching.